Good morning everyone, I hope you're okay. Please excuse the slight mess in the background. I really need to sort my drawers out, they're just so overfilled. As you can see from the title, um, we're doing a day in the life and it's actually not the weekend, it's Monday the 1st of August. So like how is it already August? That is just crazy. Um, and I actually have the day off because I have an appointment at half 10. Um, at Vista Glow Clinic, which is where I get my laser hair removal. So I've got that half ten. So I'm probably gonna leave just after half eight because last time I was late and the traffic just gets really bad because it is quite a while away from me. Um so I've got that and then we're actually house sitting for my auntie. So we've got like kind of like the week at her house. So I thought I could just spend the day showing you what I'm doing at hers. Um I'm gonna film some content at her house um and kind of just chill out I need to go to the shops get some food pack my stuff yeah some other things as well we'll just kind of see what happens and then I'm thinking I might do like some evenings in the life at her house as well because I think that'll be fun um but yeah at the moment I'm just I've literally just got up I'm gonna go make breakfast in a minute um and then be on my way <laughs> Honestly, I'm not sure if I've just broken my ring light. I was carrying it to my car and then like, I mean it was already kind of broken anyway, but it was like hanging on and then the light like fell off the, um, like the stick, I don't know what I'm saying. And because where we, <coughs> we fixed it before with like sellotape because it was like coming loose and now I fully don't feel like I can get it back on. I mean, we'll find out later because I wanted to film. I and mean, hopefully, it's like light outside and I can just film with the daylight. Otherwise, that's an issue. I'll have to buy a new one. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, so it's currently 9.47. My appointment isn't until 10.25, so I'm definitely like over half an hour early. But that's okay, like I actually didn't hit any traffic, which I knew was going to happen. Of course, the day I chose to leave super early, but that's fine. I'd rather be early than late. I'm just going to chill here, sort my phone for a bit. 
um, get my appointment done and then basically I'm going to drive to my house, pick up the rest of my stuff. I think I've got pretty much everything in, in the car. I just need to get the HelloFresh stuff out of the fridge and I'll probably make myself some lunch. And then I'm going to drive to my auntie's, drop everything off and then I'll probably get ready. I need to test the ring light, see if I can fix it as well. Um, film and then I want to pop to the shop and get some like lunch bits for the week and yeah okay so I've just come out of my appointment it is 10.50 I just had um, my point they've got like a new machine for the laser it did kind of hurt like a bitch but um, I got through it I just my pain tolerance is really bad so I'm really proud of myself like with how well I've done um, that was my fourth session my fourth session so I've just booked my fifth for September um, but yeah it hurt but you know it's worth beauty is pain it'll be worth it once it's done so i'm gonna drive back to my house now um it says that it's gonna take an hour and 25 minutes so i'm gonna drive home be back for quarter past 12 i'll make lunch pack the rest of our shit make sure i've got everything and then drive to my aunties and film some more so let's go home. i can't decide what to have for lunch i have ham and cheese wrap or sandwich and I'm just gonna grab my bits and go because I got stuff to do but I need to just look what's in the fridge a lot of drinks a lot of sauces but yeah I think I'm just gonna have a sandwich and some crisps <laughs> So I ended up making myself a ham, cheese, mayonnaise wrap, cheese box. And then I'll probably just have like, I have a little rice pudding yogurt or a chocolate bar. And I'm just going to straighten my hair, see if I straighten this hair because I don't straighten it for work. And then, and then go and get some content done. So this is the HelloFresh fresh situation. I just had to shove it in the fridge last night. So I'm going to take all this out as well as the stuff that's in the cupboard and put it in a bag to take with me in the car to put in her fridge. So I can show you like putting it in the fridge properly kind of thing. And I'm going to straighten my hair and I don't think I've actually got anything else to bring. So yeah, I think I just need to straighten my hair and then we can go. Should we go see my dog? Is he still out here? Yeah, here he is. Hello. Here's little puppy, the little buddy. Look at you. So yeah, but I'm excited because obviously she lives in a new build, so it's gonna be like having our own place. That's kind of what we're looking for for when we move out. Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. Now we've got a whole house. Like it seems so much easier. So I'd like to know what it would have been like. If Honest, honesty, guys. What a kerfuffle, right? I've got here. Drove all this way. Put the key in. The key fits but doesn't turn <coughs> because Tom has given me the back door key. Luckily, he only works down the road. So he is coming right now to give me that key because I'm sat in my car. I probably, like, if none of these people know who I am because I've only met those neighbours over there. They're probably thinking I'm, like, breaking in or something. So I'm just waiting for him. I, like, got all the bags out of the car and I can't get in. So this is just fun. So I'm just waiting for Tom. He's about 12 minutes away. And then we can get on with the day. I've got my food sitting out there. I'm like, come on, it needs to go in the fridge. I'm absolutely boiling. It's okay. I mean, at least he can help me get the stuff in the house. I guess that, that's a good thing. Okay, guys, we are actually finally in the house. I'm absolutely buzzing. The lighting in here is really good as well. And it's very, like, white. So that kind of fits with, like, my content and stuff. So I'm in the kitchen. Currently, I'm about to go put the food away. But basically, you know, my ring light was broken. Somehow, I don't actually know if this is going to stay up. But basically, I'm thinking of filming the videos, like here just in this kind of white area and I've somehow managed to I need to put the things back on it by the way I put some sellotape on and it is leaning so I think it might possibly stay up if not we'll have to I mean this natural light is quite good to be fair anyway um but thinking in that corner will be really cute but yeah I'm gonna go unload the fridge and then we can do our makeup well, actually, I'm going to try to stick those things back on without it falling and then do my makeup and then we can film. I mean, I mean, somewhere in here there is a hamster. I mean, we'll probably get him out at some point because Tom, like, always has a cuddle with him. I can't actually remember his name, but we'll find it later. I 
think it's working. I mean, this bit's not going on properly, but that's fine. Let's just. I think it's working. I've just realised. I don't think I have the lead for it. Oh. <laughs> it's all good. I found the charger. It's lighting up. It's staying up so far. So, let's go load the fridge. Okay, so I've put everything away, all the fridge stuff away, but all the cup stuff away. I've just realised I haven't actually showed you what we're having from HelloFresh this week. So we've got the smoky sausage and pepper skewers. We've got the, bah, sorry if I pronounced this wrong, Baharit lamb koftas and balsamic fig sauce. We've got the cheesy Mexican style stuffed sweet potatoes and the speedy creamy chorizo and sweet corn pasta. I don't know which one we're gonna have yet. Um, I need to like, look at the dates and stuff and think which one would be best for today. Um, yeah, I've put that all away now. So I'm gonna take the bag upstairs, go and get ready, and then we can film the next two videos. And bed test. God, my eyes are really puffy if I do that. <laughs> oh, we are in the room. Well, I'm in the room. That, I'm just kidding. That we are gonna be sleeping in tonight. Do you know what? This house is so warm. I swear, like, all houses at the moment are so warm. She said, like, we're not even putting, like, the heating on or anything. Like, it's so hot. But, oh, she's got straightness here as well. Right. So, yeah, I'm actually sweating. I'm going to go for a wee because I really need a wee. But, yeah, I'm going to be filming a Zaffle haul and a Shop Cider with Cotton On haul, like a little joint one. So, yeah, it's really exciting. And then I will do some more exciting stuff after that. Don't actually know what, probably just watch some Netflix, you know, and chill out, edit a video, and get ready for the evening. Okay, makeup is done. Honestly, it is absolutely boiling in here, like, boiling. I'm honestly sweating. Um, I've just realised I forgot my shop cider thing, which is very annoying. However, I do need to pop back at some point this week to get a delivery. So, I'll just have to go and get it then. So I won't be able to do that shop side of cotton on haul, but I am going to go film the Zaffle one. At least I have this day in the life and things like that. So I'm going to film the Zaffle haul, that'll be nice and quick. Um, and then maybe I'll do some TikToks. Um, so I used to do the Zaffle TikToks anyway, and I could do the cotton on TikToks at least. Um, and then yeah, we can chill because I'm going to do some editing and oh my god, I'm absolutely boiling. <laughs> I actually can't. So I've just been filming. I'm standing here in the place that I was filming. I think it's really cute. Like, I think it gives similar vibes to when I film at home. At home, I actually film in my mum's room. She's just got more space for me to stand. But this is where I film. I still need to film the trial clips. But I film the main part, and I'm absolutely sweating. I feel like I've mentioned that about 50 times. But yeah, I still can't find that other stuff. So I think I'm just going to film this, and then we can uh, have a little look around, film some stuff for the day in the life, get some editing done catch up on some stranger things and just kind of chill out um but at least we've, we're getting another video filmed and I might try and get some TikToks filmed if possible I've just got to find somewhere to put my phone because I don't have the thing that goes in my ring light and even if I did I think it would fall off because the ring has broken so yeah <laughs> I've been looking through the recipes of which one to have tonight I think I'm gonna go with this which is the lamb koftas with potatoes and balsamic fig sauce. Um, I was looking at the weather and it's meant to be hot like all week. And to be fair, everything we've got is quite summery meals. So I think we're gonna have that one tonight. It takes about 40 minutes. So I think I'll make it about five, five thirty. Um so yeah, currently it's about to be four o'clock, so I still got like an hour and a half. Hour, hour and a half so I'm gonna make another drink and then yeah just download that video onto my iPad and I'll watch some strange things and yeah I mean Tom will be back I think he said about half five because he might be home earlier he doesn't know so we might have him for a bit in the vlog as well um yeah at the moment I'm really thirsty so let's make a drink <laughs> So 
anyway, ignore the potato head. I thought I was on the last episode of Strange Things. Turns out I have 12 minutes left plus the last episode, which is two and a half hours. So we're going to try and finish that. Will we? Probably not. I'm enjoying this chill out day, forgetting that I'm going to work tomorrow. It's all good. It's all good. And I'm going to go do a mock exam. I have finished my early years of lecture pretty much. Um, I'm just waiting for my assessor to get back to me. Sorry. So yeah, as I was saying, I am at the end of my course. So my assessor sent me some mock exams. I've done one the other day. I just need to do the other one and then I can um, send them over. So I was looking for fish, but they were dead, but they're definitely not. So I'm going to make myself a cup of tea. So I want like a nice little warm drink to do it with. And then, yeah, get that done. I need to put my camera on charge because it's starting to get low battery. And the time is currently 20 to 5. So I'll be home in just under an hour, I'd say. And then we're going to make some dinner together. I'm really excited for this, but I think I'm guessing. Yeah, I think the balsamic vinegar is like in loads of it. I don't actually like balsamic vinegar. I don't think I read this one properly. So I probably won't put it obviously like on my salad, but I need to read like where else it is because I don't know. I feel like when you have balsamic vinegar, it's like really strong and things. But yeah, I'm sorry if this has been really boring. I feel like I haven't really done anything. Hopefully it gets more interesting when Tommy gets saying so we'll be like making dinner together and like chilling out, having a chat. Yeah, for now, I'm going to make a tea and put you on charge. Hello. <laughs> oh, Tom, I should have showed the hamster. Have you put him back? Oh, we just had the hamster out. Shall we? He's out still. Hello. Here's the hamster. I'll show you earlier. What's his name? Elsa. Anyways, it's about what time? 5 30. So I'm going to cook our dinner which I'm super excited about then like I said it's the balsamic vinegar I just spill vinegar I'm thinking I'm only gonna add half of it into the sauce because I find it really strong I don't really like vinegar but I'll still add it the other thing right I don't know about anyone else but at my house we use like that lazy garlic like we just literally just stir it and put it in and obviously I'm not at my house so I'm like I don't even know what to do with garlic so we'll figure that one out as we go along but here is everything that I need and yeah, so it's going to take about 40 minutes, but it looks really, really yummy. So, start kicking and we'll see if it is actually nice this time. And it actually looks really nice. I just don't know if I'm gonna like the sauce on it. So yeah, it's just got the lamb koftas, the potatoes, and the onion, and then tomato and rocket salad. But that's got balsamic and olive oil dressing, and then that's got like balsamic and fig something, fig jam or something sauce. Let's see how it goes. Of course, it's 
to go add some like ketchup or barbecue just to get rid of that balsamic vinegar taste but it looks really nice so I'm really excited to try it. Right, I'm gonna do a taste test. I'm scared. <laughs> Hmm, the sauce is quite nice on that, on the cofters. I didn't know if I'd like it because it's got balsamic vinegar wrapped with this salad though, I don't think. Salad is eatable, but very balsamic vinegary. Did you just say eatable? Eatable, edible. <laughs> and the potatoes are really good. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Fun I've had dinner. We're just about to go to like the shop because Tom went to the shop earlier and bought a bunch of things but forgot the lunch stuff. So we're gonna go get some bread, ham, cheese, that kind of thing. But I didn't actually show you what we got earlier. We got some cocoa pops and some crave for breakfast. We got some oranges and we got some of these cabri yogurts which we just had. <clears throat> and some grapes, blueberries and strawberries because I love those and then snack wise we got some clubs, some Yorkies what are these? some McCoys to take with us So, but we should just go get some bread and things like that here are the fish but yeah and then we're going to come back and clear up and then I bought some skincare with me from Barley Body that I got sent as PR so I thought I'll test that out tonight. I've got a moisturiser, a mask, and a hyaluronic acid serum, I think. So yeah. We've just been to Tesco Express. We got some milk. Did you know the Cravendale milk is £2.50? I didn't, I didn't see the um, Tesco's own, which is only £1.50 got some seeded bread because you know we're healthy we got some ham for our sandwiches and then because it's the love island final tonight you know i can sue and davido for the win we got some choco raisins and some marabos and then we got some custard creams at home i hope you realize there's no such thing as own brand milk oh it's a tesco oh, it is it's called tesco semi-skim milk Anyways, so we're on route. It is 7.30, so it's an hour and a half till the last final. final. Are you, do you want X soon to be there to win? He doesn't care. Well, he likes Luca, but I think Luca and Gemma are a bit boring now, if I'm honest. So X soon to be there for the win. Here's a little hamster. Hello, Elsa. How cute you are. She's quite friendly, and here's the fishies. I think they're a bit hungry, so I'm going to feed them some foodies. Yeah. Tom has been fucking letting Elsa loose and she's shut all over my notebook. <sighs> We're having doing my work. Elsa that is just not okay. Anyways, we're chilling now in the living room. We've got the TV on. Should, should shit shirt, and should. we've got the fairy lights on over there. They're in the way. Um, I can't see anything. Fairy lights are up there so as it gets darker. They'll be really, really cute. Um, then we're just waiting for the Love Island final, which starts in one hour. So we're going to eat our chocolate raisins and our hair raisins. We've washed up. We're just ready to relax. Okay. Excuse the sound of the Simpsons in the background. Tom is currently watching it. <coughs> so obviously earlier I said I was going to test out the Bondi Sands skincare that I was sent in PR. So I've got the Bondi, Bondi Bay purifying clay mask which looks like this i've got the sweet dreams night moisturizer which also which also has hyaluronic acid and squalene in it and then there's also the hyaluronic acid serum so i thought i could test these out because the mask is on for 10 to 15 minutes so i thought i could put that on now and get it all done for love island give it a test see what it's like um but the packaging is really really cute i love the little ribbed lids i think they're really pretty yeah, let's go test it out. Will Tom try it with me? I don't know. Okay, let's give the mask a go. I've just washed my face and dried it. So, just put a little bit on my hand. And I guess just start applying it. I've got a mirror down here, so if you see me looking down, that is why. I'm 
I'm just like I'm really feeling like trying. I'm really excited to try their skincare because I haven't tried any of it before. I think this will be really nice. I haven't done a mask in a while. So I think it will be really nice to try out. I can let you know my opinions. It won't dry now. But We'll leave this on for 10 minutes, I can already feel it dry on my face, that's the weirdest feeling you know when it's like on your mouth. But yeah, we'll test it out and then we'll put on the hyaluronic acid and the moisturiser. Yeah, I'm going to go chill with Tom, he's going to probably think of the house, should we go see what he stands for me? <laughs> I thought you'd have a bad reaction. Of course, I would. Because of my face. So here's a picture of me with Ryan and Marissa. I missed the bill. <laughs> oh, I guess you're only familiar with it. <laughs> okay, so I just washed off the mask. My face feels really refreshed. It feels like it's not unblemished either, which is really nice. So I've got this hanging thing. But we're just going to ignore that. So next, I'm going to try the hyaluronic acid. Um, let's try this out. I haven't tried this yet, so this will be cool. I like the bottle, it's like a squeezy tube. I'm just gonna rub that together. I love hyaluronic acid serums, I feel like it just makes your skin so glowy. And especially like after a mask, sometimes a mask that obviously slightly dries out your skin. And to be fair, that one wasn't that bad. I feel obviously serums kind of add that moisture back into your skin. I'm just gonna let that sit for a minute and then I'll apply the moisturizer. I'll try the night moisturizer now. As I said, it's got hyaluronic acid in it as well and squalene. I'm just gonna add a little bit of that. I just love the feeling of moisturizer and I feel like night night moisturizers are even better because they're really um thick. It smells quite nice as well. Oh, it's so just soothing. But yeah, that's the um skincare. I really enjoyed that. Obviously, I can't tell you my verdict because I've got to test it out for a few days. But I'm gonna keep testing it. Um and I'll let you know like the verdict on my Instagram because I think I'm gonna do like a little reel after a few days, like testing it out um, and how it like affected my skin and stuff. But yeah, my skin just feels so nice now, so I'm gonna go binge on some chocolate raisins, not gonna lie, and I've got my lime squash. So sometimes I have lemon at the nursery, and lime's really nice, I think I'm gonna have to get a lemon and lime one. So it's just really refreshing, it's really nice. But yeah, as I said, we're going to just chill now and watch Love Island. I don't know how much more I'll show you, I'll probably show you my reaction at the end of Love Island. I hope they do those speeches, I think they're so cute, you know, when they like speak to each other. Then yeah, I'm going to be doing like the evenings of my week kind of thing. It's going to be late evenings. It won't be like long. That's what I'm going to do up a week a bit. And then I'll do a weekend vlog. But, yeah. Cheers. So we just finished the Love Island final. It's now 20 to 11. I can see and David ate one, which is what I said. Tom wanted Luca and Gemma. But I literally said, I said, it's going to be X and David ate this year. Everyone is like rooting for them. And I think they'll still be together. <laughs> We've got Hammy again. It's not even called Hammy called Elsa. So we aren't really doing anything else now. We're gonna go upstairs in a minute and go to bed. So I just thought I'd end the little day in the life vlog here. I know I didn't really do too much exciting stuff but we'll be doing some evenings in the week this week so we see what we're cooking, what we're watching. So I mean we've got to finish we'll be watching Al but I don't know if we'll watch anything else as well. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you like me and you like my content, then please subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.